Hi, my name is Julie and I've got a tip for replacing a keyboard if your keyboard on your HP laptop is unresponsive or some of the keys don't work. It's actually a really easy fix, so I thought I'd post how I did it. I got my keyboard on eBay. I think they're about $12 to $18. And so the first thing you want to do is turn it off, obviously. Take the battery out. And then you'll unscrew these two and then this will pop off and then there is going to be a screw where is it right here you'll um, you'll take that screw out and then you'll open up your your laptop oh, I apologize I'm by myself holding it and then when you do that you put I just find a tiny um, screwdriver that that just has a really small tip on it like this and you will um, put it in that hole where you took the screw out which will be right here and you push on it and don't worry you're not going to damage it it scared me at first but um, I'm sorry I've got a lot of you know, it's on as jiggly you're just going to want to push hard and and uh, I've already started this one so um, with pushing that can you see the keyboard move a little bit I've already started doing this and um, oh gosh sorry let me try it again Sorry, I didn't think about how hard it'd be to actually push on this and hold a, a camera and show up. But then it just lifts right out. You'll hear it click a bunch of times, but that is not going to harm it at all. Then once you get... Um, here you can see this is the back side of the keyboard and then there's this little thing right here that holds the ribbon. You lift that up and you pull your ribbon right out and then you can just do the, the same thing with just in the reverse direction putting your, your new keyboard in. You just hold this right in there. You fold that back down so it's tight. I didn't do it all the way, but anyway, you put it in so it's tight. You turn the keyboard over and you push it down tight, and then you put the screws back in the back. It's that easy. Uh, good luck, and thanks for watching.